In my opinion, these are some of the worst products that Panini has ever released. These are the hanger boxes. I have four of them here, and I'm going to be explaining why these are the worst products, in my opinion. And also, we're going to be opening all four of them to see what we can hit out of these. All of these are from the year 2021. We have a Prism Draft, a Prestige, a Contenders, and a Don Russ. So the first one that we're going to hop into is this Prestige right here. So let's go ahead. Let's break this open. And, um, wow, this is like a brand new thing, and it's not working. All right, so let's hop into these, and I will show you guys uh, some of the stuff that you could possibly hit on the back. So there's a bunch of numbered stuff, and there should be autographs. Yep, there are autographs in here. Um, and it is one single pack so when you're buying a box uh you probably wouldn't expect it to be one single pack but um these are a singular clear pack that is a lot of cards uh, before we get into that um we do have a giveaway going on we're giving away this 2023 illusions football blaster box all you have to do to enter is like comment and subscribe on this video so make sure you guys go do that the giveaway ends at the end of the month but let's go ahead Let's hop into this, and uh, why I think this is one of the worst products is just the value um, that you get out of these. I mean, some of these products cost the same amount as a whole entire blaster box, which kind of seems insane to me, I like one pack versus a whole entire uh, blaster box. And I mean, for this product right here, this prestige one in particular, you get a ton of base cards, which I mean, for a new collector, um, that's definitely uh, something nice just to have a bunch of stuff to add to your collection. But in terms of value, I really don't think um, it's there. So let's see what this is. Oh, hey, there we go. I'll take a Trevor Lawrence Stars all day. Pretty sure this is the, um, the Hanger Box exclusive Astral uh, Parallels. So, um, you know, we got lucky there. We got the Trevor Lawrence. There's Pat Fryermuth. Amari Cooper, we got Tua, Darren Waller, and I think we're going to have a few inserts. <laughs> There's Henry Ruggs. What is this? We have a Devontae Adams uh, franchise favorites. That's a cool, interesting card. There's a Living Legends um, Warren Sapp, and then I think, no, I don't know if the rest are all going to be rookies. But let's see. Hey, there you go. Justin Fields, Devontae Smith, and there was also that Travis Etienne there. And then you're just going to have a ton of base after that. Um, so, you know, like I said, if you are a new collector, these are um, a nice product to get. But, you know, all this base cards right here, this is, you know, not even worth a dollar. So um, keep that in mind. Um, these do, like, when these came out, they cost the same as a blaster box. Now, 2021 products um, in a whole have gone down way in price just because of the players in that class. Um, so you can pick these up for about $10 to $20 each. So let's uh, sleeve up that Trevor Lawrence there. Uh, that's probably the best card that we pulled from that one there. So uh, not upset about that. That was definitely more than I was expecting. So let's uh, let's hop into yeah let's do this one let's do the prism draft picks one and let's see if we can continue to keep the good luck uh, going you get three green wave prisms per box here so uh, let's see and we can get numbered stuff so there's purple pulsars which are numbered to twenty five. And there are autographs in here. So uh, we're hoping for the purple pulsars. And that would be wild if we got one. So look at that. That's interesting. They got the cards like facing in on each other. We got a Nico Collins right there. So yeah, just one pack again. That's how all of these hanger boxes are. Uh, now a good example of uh, kind of the price difference with 
um, a hanger box is this year's 2023 Prism Football. Um, the blaster boxes go anywhere from like, well, at the store, they're what, like 35? And then aftermarket, they are um, close to like 50, something like that. And then the hanger boxes are around $40 to $50. So uh, pretty close price range for those. Um, so let's uh, let's see what we got in here. So there we go. We got Jalen Waddle there on the rookie, Patrick Sertan, and are these stuck together? Yeah, they are. And let's see. So all the good stuff is going to be back there. And it does look like we have quite a few parallels. So that's something that you definitely want to see out of a product um, like this. So let's see, here's a rookie. We got Carlos um, right there. There's Jerry Judy. Here's a silver, it's not gonna be a rookie. We got Terry McLaurin. Now here is our uh, hanger box exclusive green pulsars. We got Lamar Jackson, that's a nice looking one. Here's a rookie, we got Rondale Moore. Come on, can we get another rookie? Yep, and Nico Collins. Okay. so. Um, honestly, not too bad. I like the uh, Nico Collins rookie there and Lamar Jackson. Um, so I will definitely take that. And then we also had that uh, Jalen Waddle. But again, you know, value is still not there. I would rather have a uh, blaster box. But let's see. Uh, let's open up Don Russ first. And I believe you can get the um, Hanger Box Exclusive Optic Rated Rookie Preview Blue. So we could potentially pull, you know, a pretty big uh, Trevor Lawrence or Justin Fields card from here. And there are numbered cards in here. Uh, I don't think I've ever pulled a numbered card out of any type of hanger box or value pack or something like that. Very uh, rare, but let's see. You know, if we can hit um, the blue optic preview, that would be really nice. So um, in this one, we do have um, a ton of the base cards. So uh, it's kind of the same thing as prestige, tons of base. So again, if you're a new collector, this is um, nice to see. And I believe this is the year that they had the uh, mask variations. So let's uh, see if we can hit any of those. All these are upside down right there. And let's, uh, let's get into some of the better stuff here. So again, oh, there we go. I'll take that. We got a Jamar Chase rated rookie. One of the top rookies here. We got Sam Ellinger for the Colts. Here is Peyton Turner. We got Marquez Stevenson. And let's see, so this is a red. I'm not totally sure all of the uh, different ones. We got Hayden Hurst, Chase Young. Is this gonna be a rated rookie? I think it is. Yep, we got Rondale Moore. What is this? So this is the canvas, Rashad Bateman. And then we're gonna have um, our inserts now. So we got uh, Michael Carter there. Who's this? Aaron Jones, DeAndre Swift. So, I mean, you get a lot of uh, cool looking things in here. We got uh, Trey Sermon. Hey, there we go, Tom Brady, Super Bowl MVP. And then a Kyler Murray. So. Uh, really the only card that uh, personally I find um, intriguing is this Jamar Chase rated rookie. Now, I mean, a lot of these are, you know, nice looking cards, but in terms of value, I like the Jamar Chase there. Um, so we have one more hanger box left and uh, hopefully we can hit something a little bit better in this. And you can get the um, rookie, uh, rookie ticket autos from here. So uh, that could potentially be good. So, I mean, all of these boxes do have the potential to hit. 
Uh, you just have to be really lucky. I mean, I've opened up a lot of products and these hangers have not uh, been good in terms of value. So, I mean, that's why, you know, ultimately I'm telling you guys to uh, be cautious when you're buying these because you're not always going to get uh, your value back. I mean, that goes with really any product that you're buying, but especially these here. You now, if you're, if you're buying these for the same price as a blaster box, I would always go for the blaster box instead of these. There's usually like zero to little value uh, from these right here. So uh, we got all the base here. Hey, there's a T Higgins. And I'm going to stop right here. We do have a show today on whatnot. We're going to be doing packs and singles at a dollar, mostly packs. Uh, so make sure you guys come join us. It's going to be at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you guys have not signed up for whatnot yet, make sure to use the link in the description. You can get a free $10 in credits. So I hope to see you guys there. Come hang out with us tonight. Go bookmark the show. But let's keep going. Okay, so, hey, I will take that. And Amon Ra, St. Brown, uh, this is the red rookie, or they're called rubies um, on the box. We got a Derek Carr, a Darren Waller winning ticket. That's a cool looking card. We got Saquon Willis McGee. Here is Michael Carter. There we go, a Jamar Chase and Kyle Pitts rookie. There's a Joe Burrow MVP, Aaron Rodgers winning ticket. So again, this is like most of these uh, boxes, you're going to get a lot of uh, cool, interesting cards. That's kind of how uh, Panini makes up the cost of these boxes. But, you know, a lot of these cards are 25 cents or less than that. Um, so, yeah, let me know what you guys think about these products in the comments. But there are, I mean, that's a cool card. We got a Tom Brady in his uh, Patriots jersey. So that's definitely a cool one. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for the giveaway. Use the link in the description for a free $10 uh, when signing up with Whatnot. But let's see what the last card is. It's going to be Randy Moss.